Hey YouTubers, okay, I just washed my hair, um, and the products that I use, these are the product. this is the products what I use, and what I'm going to be using, um, this is what I used, okay, shampoo, let's see, where's my shampoo, okay, since I, uh, had the braids in for three months, and I was using a leave-in conditioner and greasing up my scalp, Every so often, keeping it moisturized, I use this Mazzani Renew Strength uh, Fortifying Shampoo. It's basically a clarifier to get all the buildup out of your hair. So I did, I rinse, used that once, and it cleans out all the dirt and all that stuff like right away. So my hair was yes, <laughs> really, really dirty. <laughs> um, and then I used. My uh, Biolage Strengthening Shampoo. Um, it is actually, it, it helps prevent breakage and repair damaged chemically treated hair. And I used that once. Um, then I use my Strengthening Conditioner that also helps prevent breakage and repair damaged chemically treated hair. And I use that once, and I, I probably kept that on for maybe a few minutes. But um, while I was washing my hair, you don't make sure that your hair is all combed out before you go in a wash because it will eliminate tangles. So I decided to, I did that, and uh, instead of scrubbing my head like crazy, I mean I scrubbed it, but I did it softly because I didn't want my hair to end up getting extremely tangled and wear more because when your hair is wet it's at its um, weakest state also so you have to be very careful so you guys are probably asking why is this hat on my head I'm actually deep conditioning it and as you guys see I used up all the rest of my conditioning concoction there's mayonnaise in it there's a ton of different oils um, there's ton of different grease, there's like, uh, not grease, I'm sorry. There's like a ton of different stuff in it mixed all together, but mainly mayonnaise. Mainly mayonnaise. Um, I gotta make some more later on. Um, and then I also used this, uh, I had bought this a while back and I'm just barely using it. I think it's like a leave-in. Let me see. Um... No, it's not a leave-in. It's not. It's basically like with the deep conditioner. So I used up all this concoction and then I mixed it and I put this underneath it. So I put the concoction, this, concoction, and this. And this is the olive moisturizing treatment. And it has olive oil and silk protein in it from Silk Elements. This is the first time I'm using this, so we'll see what it does. Um... After, I'm going to leave it on for a while, maybe probably 30 minutes. I'm not going to send it, I'm not going to send a dryer. It is like too late for that. I am so tired. So I'm just going to leave it on for about 30 minutes, then rinse it out. And then after that, I'll put in my daily leave-in tonic from Biolage. This is an excellent leave-in conditioner. Excellent. It works, it works perfectly on my type of hair. And then after that, I'm going to put in, um, what is this? Uh, my shea butter, as you guys can see, it's like worn out because of the relaxer I had got on it. But it's a shea butter leave-in conditioning repair cream. So I'm going to put this in afterwards. Um, then af after that... Then I'm going to put in my, um, you know what, I'm sorry. This will actually be before the shea butter. This is Healthy Sexy Hair Soy Tree Wheat Leave-In Conditioner. So I'm going to put this in. So I'm going to have two leave-in conditioners in it. And then after all that's done, after the shea butter, then when I, I got to tie it up at night, I'm going to let it air dry while it's tied up all nice. And then I'm going to put this olive oil smooth and hold uh, putty in it a little bit. So um, when I do do it tomorrow, 
it'll be okay. I just don't want it to really frizz up too much. So I'm just going to use just a tiny bit just around the edges. And it's an olive oil smooth and whole putty pudding and organic root stimulator. Um, those are the products that I'm going to be using. Oh, I also am going to be using this. Uh, it's like silk elements. It's like a leave-in. Uh, it's a heat protected that I'm going to be using tomorrow to flat iron my hair. So I will try to do another video after it's already flat ironed. But actually, I think I've seen seen some growth, actually. Um, hopefully, it's a very good growth. But um, I won't be trimming my ends for a while because every time I do my braids, I always clip probably a half an inch off when I'm taking the braids out. So um, I'm going to let you guys go. Comment below, like or dislike below, subscribe up top, ask me questions, any videos, any ideas. Uh, you guys take care. God bless you and have a nice day and night. Peace.